and spreads abroad her wings and takes them up upon them so and beareth them unto safety to them salvation bring the Lord alone did feed him and was no strange God with him he made him ride on high places of the earth that he might eat the increase of the fields and he made him honey suck out of the rock and oil from out of the flinty rock but to of kine and milk of sheep with fat of lambs and rams those bred in Bashan and goats with the heart of wholesome wheat and thou did drink the pure blood of the great but Jeshurun, he did wax fat and kicked against. You've grown fat and are thick, and with this fat you are covered. Then he forsook God, which had made him and lightly esteemed his rock of salvation. They provoked him to jealousy with strange gods and with those abominations aroused him provoked him to anger. They sacrificed unto devils, not to God, but to gods, whom they knew not to know gods that more recently came up. God's who your fathers did not fear of the rock that bore you. Thou art unmindful and forgot the God that had formed you. When the Lord saw it, he abhorred them because of Their provocation by his sons and of his daughters too. And he said, I will hide my face from them, I will see what therein shall be for they are a very forward people, a generation contrary, children that have no faith, they have moved me to jealousy with that which is not God. They have provoked me to anger with their vanities, and I will move them to jealousy with a nation of fools. I'll vex 
save them with a people who are not a people from my anger a fire is made and kindled shall it burn unto the lowest hell and shall consume the earth with her increase and set on fire thee the mountains foundations i will heap mischief upon them i will spend mine arrows upon with hunger and devoured with burning heat and with the bitter destruction I'll also send the teeth of beasts upon them with poison of serpents of the dust the sword without terror within shall destroy both the young man and the virgin see suckling with the man of gray hairs I said I would scatter them to four corners of the earth and make their memory to cease from among other men. I did not want their enemies to boast that they had won this victory and say that I Yahweh had not this done their nation is of counsel void nor do they understand that they and understood think on their latter end how could one person chase thousands and put ten thousand to to flight except their rock them sold and the Lord shut them up for their rock is not as our rock, even our enemies themselves be judges, it thereof our enemies agree. For their vine is of Sodom's vine, and of Gomorrah's fields. Their grapes are grapes of gall as such, their clusters are bitter. Their wine, the poison of dragons, their cruel venom asps, is not this laid up in store with, sealed up with my treasures? To me belongeth recompense and vengeance, all is mine their foot shall slide in its due time their day of destruction 
The day of their calamity is at hand, and the things that shall come upon them will make haste, for the Lord shall be judge. The Lord shall judge his people and repent. For his servants, when he sees that their power is gone and there is none that do remain or are then left, and he shall say, Where are their gods, their rock in trust which did eat of the fat their sacrifices and drank wine of their drink offerings let them rise up and be your help and your protection be See now that I, even I am He, and there is no God other than me or them beside. I kill and make alive. I wound and I heal, so neither is there. Deliver out of my hand, for I lift my hand up to heaven and say that I do live forever and ever. If I wet my glittering sword and my Judgment I will render vengeance unto mine enemies and will reward them that hate me. I'll make my arrows drunk with blood and my sword shall devour flesh and Revenge upon the enemy, rejoice, O you nations, his people, for he will avenge the blood of his servants, and will render vengeance to his adversaries and will be merciful unto his land and to his people still because I will declare the name of God's Son Yeshua Ascribe greatness unto our God, the rock his works perfect. For all his ways are judgment born, a God of perfection.